Hi, welcome to our yoga practice to help open up the respiratory system. Um, I wanted to share with you a couple of practices I've been doing recently um, to help clear a um, runny nose that I had and a cough as well. And I've, I've been doing these practices to really help my respiratory system to open up. So the first practice is energy block release three, which is a really lovely sequence. Um, it not only calms the body and mind um, fantastically, but it also really helps to open up the lungs and you can really get a lot of oxygen into your body and start to help your body to heal and rebalance itself. And then we'll be practicing a pranayama exercise, so a breathing exercise called the pigeon breath, which again really helps to clear um, respiratory um, issues like bronchitis, um, helps with you know long-term maintenance of asthma and things like that and it really helps has helped me to clear out um, all of this this kind of bug that I've had so I wanted to share them with you today so hop onto your mat and we'll get started so coming into Tadasana you're going to just take your awareness down to your feet and just position your feet on the mat so that you can feel the front of your feet, the sides of your feet, the inner edges of your feet and the heels of the feet. And as you exhale, take the breath down through the feet and just start to really tune into that connection into the earth. And just feel that your weight is balanced evenly through your feet. Gently beginning to soften into the knees. We're gonna bring the pelvis into neutral by just tilting it back and forward to the extreme movements that you can do and then positioning it somewhere in the middle between those two movements. We're gonna take a breath in and just draw the abdominal muscles back slightly towards the spine, just engaging your core muscles, lifting through the chest, take the shoulders up and let the shoulder blades rest in the pockets in the back of, upper back of your body. And just feeling that length from your shoulders up through the sides of your neck now. Your chin is parallel to the floor and you can feel the length through the back of the neck. So let's just take a couple of deep breaths here and just start to bring some fresh oxygen into your system, really feeling as you inhale the whole that you're breathing all the way down to the rib cage, front and back of your body. Softening as you exhale, one more time. Exhale. Final time. Exhale, awareness to your hands, just sinking down into the knees. We're gonna raise the arms up. If there's any problems with blood pressure, just have your hands a little bit lower down um, than, where, than having them high up. So let's take our awareness to the hands, the palms, turn them up towards the ceiling. And just start to imagine that lovely warm light from the sun is filling your palms and just bringing that gorgeous sunlight down into your body. Just imagining that light is healing every cell of your body as it travels all the way down to your feet. And then when you're ready, we're going to turn to the right, come into a twist and just let your right arm drop behind you, turn back to the front. We're going to raise that arm up again. Turn to the left, left arm drop behind you, face the front, raise up. So we're just twisting. So we're going to twist, take a breath in as you breathe out, let your arm drop, face the front, inhale, twist. Exhale, arm drops down. I'm going to inhale. Exhale. Inhale. 
And just keep flowing with this movement and as you inhale really focus on the rib cage expanding the lungs are expanding and just working with an expansion that feels comfortable for your body so you're not pushing it so that your breath is really labored just work with a gentle expansion that works for your body final time on the right side final time on the left it's quite a strengthening exercise that one as well oh, just bring in your palms they turn away from you at this stage in front of your heart center then we're going to turn the right palm towards us take a breath in as you exhale just let the palm travel behind you so you come into a twist left arm is at the front you're going to look back towards that right palm take a breath in exhale travel back to center excellent left palm faces towards you take a breath in exhale left palm travels behind you take a breath in expand exhale palm travels back towards you both palms now face as though you're hugging a tree towards your heart center take a breath in exhale soften the knees inhale chest opens and expands exhale and again just taking your focus to your lungs to the rib cage and just allow it to expand with each inhalation exhale either through the nose or if you really want to clear out the respiratory system and breathing out through your mouth final time and then bringing the hands back to the heart elbows drop we're going to start to expand the chest now so i'm going to show you side on because there's a little bit of a spinal wave involved in this movement so we're going to inhale and your palms are going to expand out chest opens up shoulder blades back together exhale round your back off inhale open up the chest gentle back bend exhale round in the back off so just keep moving working with that movement Ex and your each time that you open your arms you're just expanding that little bit further exhale inhale exhale inhale final time really opening the chest exhale right hand then drops down towards the right hip fingers are pointing away so your hand is like this and then opposite so your hand let me move it is like this you're going to push it up and push down really opening up the left side of your body exhale hands come back to heart inhale open up the right side of your body exhale hands to heart inhale open up the left exhale final time opening up the right hands to heart beautiful taking the feet a little bit wider you're going to turn your right foot to 90 degrees your left foot is going to come to 45 and you can have your feet a little bit wider if that helps with your balance um, you can also make just make sure if you are doing the same alignment as me that your the heel is in line with your instep as i said if that's too much for your balance then just take your feet a little bit wider we're going to take the right arm up the left thumb is going to go over the little and the ring finger and you're going to place the index and middle finger in the space between the right hand index um, finger and thumb we're going to inhale draw the left elbow back exhale knee comes over the ankle and no further inhale gentle back bend exhale 
really focusing on opening up the left side of the body exhale let's lower the hands down swap over to the opposite side left hand comes up thumb the right hand over the index and little finger fingers into the space between the thumb and the index finger of the left hand elbow back inhale exhale inhale really opening up the right side of your body now fantastic relaxing down keep the feet wide we're going to come into a forward bend any disc injuries at all then just keep yourself up like this otherwise just dropping down to your knees see how that feels for you if that's enough stay there otherwise dropping down and just letting your back relax out Take in a couple of breaths here. And then we're going to bend into the knees. Draw the tummy muscles back towards the spine and slowly uncurl. Take the shoulders up. Relax them back. Right foot goes back to 90 degrees. Left heel is at 45. This is the final movement of this posture and we're going to place the <clears throat> left hand on the left thigh and then you're going to turn your hips to face me and raise your arm up and then as you exhale quite firmly you're going to go turn the hips back to where you started. So let's inhale, big expansion, exhale, inhale, exhale hand drops down we go over to the other side so you're really opening up and clearing out the lungs now so right hand by right thigh let's inhale open up inhale fantastic inhale final time and then relaxing back down walking your feet back to hip width apart you're going to inhale, raise the arms back towards the ceiling, towards the sky. Palms facing that beautiful warm sunlight, just closing your eyes. And we're now going to turn the palms to travel, to face towards the crown of the head and allow this light to travel down through your body. Just imagining that your whole body, every cell is filling with sunlight and you're going to start to just lower your arms as though you're hugging that tree again. You can just have a look at the movement if you're not sure. And just imagine that you're bringing this gorgeous circle of light. It's going to heal every cell of your body. And then bringing your arms back down by the side of your body. My chicken has just arrived at the door. I'm not sure if you can hear her. Her name's Doris. So just take a couple of breaths here. Just notice how you feel. It's a beautiful sequence to really calm the body and mind. bringing your hands onto your heart centre. Take a few breaths with the focus on really nourishing yourself at a very deep level to help your body to heal and rebalance. And then when you're ready, just opening your eyes and bringing your hands down by your sides. So grabbing a cushion, a bolster, a chair, <clears throat> a chair, um, something to sit on whilst we go through um, the pigeon breath exercise. 
<coughs> hey, Doris. I'll now take you through the pranayama technique called the pigeon breath and as I mentioned before this is a really fantastic way to uh, clear um, the respiratory um, part of your body you know the the lungs um, and it really okay I'll cut that I'll now take you through the pigeon breath and this, as I said, is a fantastic um, pranayama exercise to really clear out the lungs. So let's bring, I'll show you the movements first. The first movement is you inhale through the nose and take your head back and take your arms up. Then you exhale through the mouth, blowing all of the air out of your lungs. <sighs> Keeping the head up hands drop down, you inhale through your nose, exhale through the nose and bring the head back to center. Okay, so let's bring the palms clasped together, elbows together or close to. We're gonna inhale through the nose. Exhale out through the mouth, elbows down. Head stays where it is, inhale through the nose. Exhale, head back to center. Exhale through the nose. Inhale through the nose. Exhale, head tilts back through the mouth. Really empty your lungs, staying in that position, elbows down. Inhale through the nose, arms stay where they are. Exhale, head comes back to center. Inhale, elbows up. Exhale through the mouth, head tilts back. Inhale through the nose. Exhale, head back to center. So the first two movements, the arm move up and down. Inhale. Exhale, arms down, head back out through the mouth. Head still, inhale through the nose. Exhale through the nose, head back to center. So let's continue with that. I'll just carry on with the movements. When you can follow. Let's do that three more times. Final time.
And then just allowing your arms to relax down on the knees. Keeping the eyes closed or closing your eyes. Just allow your breathing to return to normal. Just notice how you feel. And starting to bring your awareness to your feet. Breathe in and just take in your breath into your feet and then allow your feet to soften down. Taking a breath into the legs. Imagine just filling the legs with your breath and as you exhale, letting the legs soften down. Breath travels into the belly, the hips, softening as you exhale. Breath filling the chest and the lungs once more. Softening down, let your chest, your lungs, your shoulders just soften and relax. Breathing into the arms, the hands. Allow softness to fill that space as you exhale. Breathing up into the neck, front and back. Allowing the throat to soften as you exhale. Taking the breath so it fills the face up to the crown, the back of the head. And allow your face to soften. The eyes relax, the forehead, the crown of the head. Bring your hands into prayer position. Just taking a moment to Give gratitude for yourself to allowing yourself to take time for yourself, for your own healing. It's so important that we do this. Thank you so much for joining me. I've loved taking you through this sequence as it's been so helpful for me over the last couple of weeks. Have a wonderful day. Namaste.